Natasha. Debbie. Show. The show. <laughs> Welcome to it. <laughs> Just two patriotic girls. Learning about the world. So please, don't take us the wrong way. You gotta do something to help me. I'm tired. I gotta wake up. We're gonna wake you up. I need something to energize me, to help me to... You know. We are so gonna wake you up. Today's yeah. video is supposed to be good and funny. Yeah. It's been recommended by quite a few people. Yes. Since we've taken a look at some locations to travel to, ways to get there, and some of the culture stuff. Today we're gonna sit back, we're gonna relax a little bit, and we're gonna take a look at memes about Australians. Heck yeah, I'm excited about this one. We haven't looked at any memes um, ever, actually, on any of our videos. No, we haven't. It's odd. <laughs> so this is new for us. This will be fun, I hope. Um, again, if there's anything negative here, we didn't, we, we didn't make this. No, we are not responsible. <laughs> it came, um, have, I'm gonna move this down a little bit. It came highly suggested. It's not been out for very long, just a couple weeks. And um, we're excited to check these out. Um, I'm sure there's going to be probably some stuff that we probably won't understand. Hopefully not. Maybe. We'll see. Um, if we don't, then I, we, that's where we're lying in the comments for you guys. <laughs> but um, we're going to sit here and check these out and hopefully have a laugh together. If you guys like the content we put out, please smash that like button and consider subscribing to the channel. Um, so let's do this. Let's we'll look and check out some memes about Australians. In Australia, we don't lock our doors because we're scared of armed intruders. We lock our doors to keep the ruse out. A rare image of an American and an Australian in a public bathroom at what? the same time. The end of Australia. <laughs> Australia versus Paluto. I had no idea they had beef. Australia man caught a sea monster with no eyes and a mouthful of sharp teeth. I feel like Australia is where the devil keeps his beds. Oh, it's wow. time of human evolution. That's just an Australian. Looks like frost, but it's spider- I was going to. Too. I know, he's going pretty fast. <laughs> this is gonna be a fast video, so make sure you pay attention quickly. Does that make sense? Pay yes. attention quickly. Alternative. That's hilarious. Alternative human evolution. No, that's just an Australian. Human yeah. evolution. That's just an Australian. <laughs> that's classic. That's hilarious. These are already great. <laughs> All right. Australian looks like frost, but it's spider season in Australia. Ew. What? Those are spider webs. <laughs> I'm not afraid of spiders, but that's a little much. I'm not either. And that, 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 that's just funny. That's like a horror flick. I should be in jail. Burn the whole country. Burn oh, damn. My bad. A cow caught casually eating snake in Outback Australia. I am confused as to how the food chain works in Australia. I'm also confused on how the food chain works in Australia. Why? And ew, you know I hate snakes. Blah. Yeah, I've never seen a cow eat a snake. I hope that isn't a cow you're using for beef. <laughs> it probably is. Never, I can never, I, I'm glad I don't eat beef. Could be snake milk. It could be. The cow eats a snake, turns into milk. Oh, I heard you, and I'm just going, okay. Yeah, ew. <laughs> Let's continue. <laughs> These are crazy. <laughs> Yeah. Australian farmer celebrates rain falling on farm for the first time in months after the Australian Aww. bushfires 2020. Mm. Australians have accidentally been eating a fish unknown to science. Thank goodness. Usually it's the other way around. Fish <laughs> unknown to science is eating Australians. Save the animals in Australia. Animals. Yeah, yeah. Very funny. Let's all laugh at Australia for having all the deadly animals. Two of those aren't even real dummies. Two of those. Wait, what? Why do so many people think spiders are evil and out to get you? Look at this Nerd, run away in an overly dramatic cartoonish way just because something touched its bug. <laughs> Hashtag spot the Australian. Punching sharks. Now declared Australia's oh, national wow. sport. <laughs> That's hilarious. And we know oh, from Shark that Week funny. that you should do that. But that picture is hysterically messed up and fake, obviously. But it is fake. Yes. But still, it's hilarious. <laughs> That's hysterically funny. That's awesome. <laughs> Can we get that in the Olympics, please? Shark punching. Australia wins the gold again! Because yeah. <laughs> they were the only country that went into that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's hilarious. Bought. Each year, in an Australian park, hundreds of people bring their handmade cardboard what? creations to battle with other participants in a giant cardboard war known as Box Wars. The that is awesome. Sea. <laughs> really? Really? Is that, that is real? awesome. We need to do that. Mm -hmm. We need to have a Natasha and Debbie show Box Wars. Ooh. Is this a thing? Please let us know about this. <laughs> 
It's awesome. The participants in a giant cardboard and crazy. wall known as Box Wars. The Mediterranean Sea fits perfectly inside of Australia. Australia, do this. If this happened, it would drown <laughs> nearly five people. That's terrible. Australian's woman national team lose seven nil to a team of 15 year old boys. How about no? Is this a Halloween decoration or a picture of a house in Australia? <laughs> the most dangerous flightless bird in Australia is sitting oh. under a beach umbrella, stealing grapes. Are you going to tell what's basically a dinosaur that it can't have your grapes or beach spot because I'm not. The porker is a marsupial native to Australia. They aren't no. afraid of humans and approach them frequently. Evolution's apology for the fact that every other animal in Australia wants to rip your face off. Hashtag Sydney Storm. Non-Australian. I got hit by a hailstone. It hurts. Oh yeah. Those spikes are brutal. What? The what now? This is a sea pickle. A wow. Hurts. Oh yeah. Those spikes. Is that really a thing? I know. What are spikes on a... Uh... On our hail, hail, hail they're, they're yeah. usually just balls, what? but not spiked balls. Okay. That's pretty wild. I, I don't know what's real, what's not real. I'm assuming it's real, but that's just <laughs> hilariously messed up, and, and that would be scary. It's Definitely. Brutal, the what now? This is a sea pickle, a blob of pyrosomes that live in the ocean. This one was caught off the east of an Australian coast. Bro caught his Snapchat. Thousands of people plan to attend a barbecue in front of in front of the home of a vegan Australian woman no. who took her neighbors to court over the smell of That's meat cooking in their own backyard. That's mean. Australia is mental. This is an actual photo of a dog eating a shark while what? two snakes fight to the death. Aus no, go back. Oh, I didn't even see the snake up front oh, there. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> I didn't even see the shark back there. I just saw the I saw the shark, I didn't see the snake. Those snakes aren't <laughs> fighting. So, this is an actual photo of a doggy. I don't think those snakes are fighting. Ting a shark no. or two Maybe not. <laughs> I mean I've never seen a snake mate, but could be. Snakes Moving fight on. to the death. Australian drug addict dresses up as cop and raids another drug addict's home. <laughs> the hint is on for the culprit who stole a giant 10 meter high mango in Australia overnight. Australian news. Where did the mango? How Australian? <laughs> Where did the mango? <laughs> That's good. I haven't looked at any memes in a little while, but these are some of the funnier ones I've ever seen yeah, in my life. Yeah, they are. They're great. And I'm already looking at this one, and it's hilarious. I don't even know why, but it's just funny. Look at this kangaroo. Like, yeah. <laughs> That's my impersonation of kangaroo. I sure hope you guys are having fun watching these two. They're, these are great. Look at him in the picture. Okay, I can't wait to see this one. How Australian can you get? This just bloke was there. six foot tall. Good. This guy was six foot tall. Fun Australian fact. This kangaroo is waiting for pursuers to come into the water with him, no. where he will try to drown them. Really? They're extremely mm. good at it. Really? This guy really flew her all the way from <laughs> Australia. Australia is beautiful. See a hawk literally throw a snake at an innocent family. Oh this no. This really reassures me about my upcoming Australia work trip. In 2013, <laughs> an Australian man set up a ghost catching camera. Instead of ghosts, he caught his girlfriend doing it with his own son. Australian <laughs> McDonald's oh. is pooping on American McDonald's. What the hell? Rare mutation. <laughs> <laughs> golden Australian possum is named Pikachu. A oh, possum what? broke into an Australian bakery and <laughs> ate so many pastries it couldn't move. This is how they found him. <laughs> My dad got jumped by a kangaroo today. Damn. Oh. One week in Australia. That's a lot going on. Yeah. Oh. sharing a meal. I thought this was a new spider from Australia. What? I thought it was a spider Australian too. Animals will kill you. Don't get me wrong. He wants to. He just can't. <laughs> Australian Prime Minister says he didn't poop his pants at McDonald's in 1997. 100% chance this guy pooped his pants at McDonald's in 1997. <laughs> my friend left her window open in her bedroom and came back to find this. Look at his self-satisfied little face. Australia. <laughs> there was a post to describe Australia. <laughs> this is it. Having an Australian accent is like being sent to prison for a crime I didn't commit. Oh. Being Australian is because of a crime you didn't commit. Cruel. Never forget. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Not right. <laughs> Oh, I love that you guys take the piss out of yourselves like this. I oh, mean, we all definitely. do to a point, but this is pretty damn funny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and what we learned about the, you know, the British sending the, you know, the criminals to yes. Australia a lot of yes. <laughs> it's just funny. I mean, I knew about Americans, but I didn't mm -hmm. know about Australia, so, but that's... Didn't commit. Being Australian is because of a crime you didn't commit. Cruel. Never forget, first ever Olympics gold medal was won because the guy was coming dead last, and everyone in front of him fell over. A national hero. <laughs> so really? Australians reproduce. We throw a boomerang, and whoever catches it is our designated man. Why is a kangaroo smashing a pig? Why is the duck watching? Why is what? there a ten-foot tall guy with a spear in the back? Austra True. <laughs> 
a pig? Why is the duck watching? Why is there a ten foot tall guy with a spear in the What in the holy crap am I looking at? <laughs> I'll show you gone wild. I don't know. Um, that's some oh I feel wrong. Oh wow. I think we should censor this at this moment. A little late now, but um Okay. Um okay. Okay, and let's move on. I, I, <laughs> I'm fine. In the back, Australian man involved in a shark attack beats shark to death with his unsubdued <laughs> leg. Do you know what to do if you're bitten by a tarantula hawk wasp? Hey, Debbie. By a what? If I was an Australian magpie, <laughs> would you guys still like me? Answer me. Australian young dad almost made his child blind. Andrew, 28 years old dad, couldn't stop his kids crying, so he poured no tears shampoo directly into his eyes. No. <laughs> Now that's what you call beautiful irony. <laughs> no tear shampoo. Oh, I can't Don't do that. that one. Don't do that. <laughs> Doesn't work that way. <laughs> beautiful irony. <though. laughs> this is actually, this is horrible. There was it's a bad. man named Joseph who escaped an Australian prison so many times they built a special cell just for him. He escaped that as well. <laughs> you know sweatpants. In Australia, we called them tracky decks. I'm starting to think you Aussies are just fucking with us. <laughs> you actually aren't. And that's the horrendous part. My Australian friend fully into the sky after I break his ground harness. Baby kangaroos saved from the Australian wildfire. You know what really annoys Aww. me about Australians? They call McDonald's Maccas. Why? What? My friend. You do? Or is that, was that you a joke? You know what really annoys me about Australians? They call McDonald's Maccas. Why? <laughs> okay, I need an explanation. I don't know. I didn't know that. I, I didn't know that. Yeah. I did find out though by accident on, on, on something online the other day that Burger King there. Crap, forgot the name. You'll let us know oh, in the comments. Phone. You got your phone. Hungry Jacks. Same logo and everything. My friend just went out for dinner, and this guy turned up at the window like he had a reservation. So this bird lands on the deck, <laughs> takes a poop, and then looks at me like he wants to start a he fight. He does! Monty bought a kangaroo and let it go in the house. Sometimes I get mad at Australian stereotypes, but then I remember that my backyard looks like this. <laughs> Who would win? Every creature in Australia, every Florida man, they would breed. I hate how this is a viable option. <laughs> Finally, some good news. Australia is healing. Due to less pollution, Earth is now visible from Australia. <laughs> Listening to this from Australia, that's so sick. Thanks for the support. I didn't say I liked it or it was good. Sounds like shit. English summer. OMG. It's, I'm melting. It's so hot. Australian summer. It's a little hot today. Aussie <laughs> wife is slammed for packing her husband's lunch. Stop treating him like your child. Don't talk to me or my son ever again. Dog head versus cat's head. Australia. Well, there's another thing I'll never unsee. Wallaby hops along Sydney Hello. cat's head. Australia. That, that's. I never thought of it that that's, way. Uh, that's messed up. That is pretty cool. <laughs> have, you ever, have you ever seen and, this? And cat food. I like cat food down <laughs> That's actually really funny. <laughs> Well, there's another thing I'll never unsee. <laughs> Wallaby hops along Sydney Harbour Bridge, surprising motorists, so they race cars. Australia <laughs> accent came from alcoholic slur of early settlers, says expert. I've pretty much never been less surprised by anything. <laughs> New password. Australians. Strong. New password. Emus. <laughs> Alright, that was... That was a good one. Clever. <laughs> Australians aren't real people. Australians, it's not that dangerous here. Claw machines in Australia. <laughs> Many tears will be shed in Australia. Roger the Roo dies, age 12. I don't know Roger, Australian but... guys encounter great white shark around their boat. I would be saying the same thing. Man with beer in one <laughs> hand and a hose in other defends his home from the fire. Australia. Yeah, that's pretty much every summer ever for us. Accurate. <laughs> Welcome to Australia, where a fast food restaurant literally made mirrored reflective sea golf proof packets for their fries so they don't try Try to fly down and steal your fries. Australian Seriously? man that is makes awesome. the ham dog a hot dog and burger combo. POV, <laughs> you are trying to sleep in Australia. Pig in Australia steals 18 beers from campers, gets drunk, fights cow. <laughs> Western Australia, collecting huge amounts of snake infested sea foam. Courageous border no. collie leads 900 sheep to safety during Aww. Australian I, I love him. An Australian man typed every number from 1 to 1 million in words, not numbers, on his typewriter. It what? 16 years, wow. Okay. <laughs> Don't know why, but okay. 
Took him 16 years. I was applying for an Australian citizenship and the interviewer asked, do you have a criminal record? I said, no, is that still required? Oh my God. Newly discovered Australian spiders can swim and eat toads. I'm never going to Australia. Flat earthers claim Australia doesn't exist and people who live there are paid okay. actors by NASA. OMG. I didn't know Google Translate does Australian. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming this evening. Oh no. Shallows and gentle joeys. Australian helicopter <laughs> owners are dropping thousands of vegetables to feed the wildlife Aww. affected by the Australian bushfires. Awesome. Footage of an Australian guy fishing from a drone is being investigated by authorities. Rescued this little guy today. Not all animals in Australia want to see you die. Dorito rewards Australian teenager with $20,000 for finding an air-filled Dorito chip in her bag and then putting it on eBay. What? Australians who won't <laughs> unlock their phones could face 10 years in jail. As an Australian, I'm sick of all the stereotypes. I go about my day just like the rest of you. The Australian firehawk. I got you. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I can't, I can't help you here. I don't know. <laughs> that looks totally um innocent and not weird and creepy and, and wrong and everything. I possible. mean... <laughs> I like to wear my koala as a backpack on my face while I'm uh, driving. I mean, you might as well. <laughs> as an Australian, I'm sick of all the stereotypes. I go about my day just like the rest of you. <laughs> what is coming out of the, the, the oh. seat behind his arm there? It's like a piece of like greenery. Some bamboo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good stuff. Good oh, stuff, Australia. Goodness. I love you guys so much more now. <laughs> I already did, but now it's just so much uh -huh. higher. It's just, the love's even higher. Stereotypes. I go about my day <laughs> just like the rest of you. The Australian firehawk drops burning sticks into the dry areas to further spread wildfires. What? Thereby catching fleeing prey. Australian mm -hmm. man pleads guilty to storming animal shelter to get his cat back. Quick. The Australians are asleep. Post pictures of normal outdoor animals. As an Australian, this is all I know about American geography. You went around Texas. Australian <laughs> films versus Australian in real life. Instagram <laughs> raises $500,000 for Australian bushfires by selling nude photos for $10. Good job. When an <laughs> Aboriginal Australian girl graduated college in 2016, her grandfather, an Aboriginal elf who lives on a remote island, traveled almost 2,000 miles to attend the ceremony in wow. Dance With Me. Australian problems. If you're ever feeling down, <laughs> to attend the ceremony in Dance With Her. Australian <laughs> Yeah, turn around. <laughs> Those things look like monsters, man. They look like they have steroids. Oh. Doesn't that king really has a yeah. like it's on steroids? Like woof. Definitely look like it's gonna kick your ass. Uh, yeah, I, I'm scared now. I like kangaroos, but um, I don't <laughs> They kinda look like a greyhound like on, on steroids standing up. Uh, I don't sure. Know. I don't know. Yeah. Problems. If you're ever feeling down, just remember that 52,000 Australians have signed a petition to change the Australian currency to dollary dues. <laughs> and you hear that flow of Australia looks all for me f looked awfully familiar to the Death Star. Yeah, it does. <laughs> Meanwhile, in Australia, roads subject to melting. <laughs> Indicators show depth. Australia's <laughs> families live in fear of the huge kangaroo haunting their suburban streets. Uh, what uh, is yeah. going on in Australia? America. <laughs> our national bird is the eagle. Hey. And it is a beauty and it symbolizes freedom. It does. India. Mm -hmm. Our national bird is the peacock because its beautiful colors that. represent our country and its glory. Australia. Our national bird is emus and we hate <laughs> them and lost a war against them. <laughs> Jamaican's world's second fastest man is visibly stunned after being beaten by a mullet sporting Australian <laughs> sprinter whose name he doesn't even know in 100 meter heat. <laughs> you okay. Can you take this one? Uh, of course, one? he had to have a mullet, right? I, know. I, I think, mean, that that's it, that was probably worse than it was a mullet. A reminder, Debbie's a hairstylist. Australia. And you love mullets. But, you know, those mullets, you they, love can, them. they can definitely help you with wind resistance. <laughs> she, she, she's like, didn't you have some kid? He's one of your clients. You're like helping him grow on a mullet. Yeah, it's getting pretty long now. That's hilarious. <laughs> Australia gifted the royal baby, a pet crocodile that was born on the same day as the royal baby, and thus has been named George. They're twins. Australia reptilian conspiracy to place a croc on the throne. Who the hell thinks a crocodile is an appropriate gift for a baby? Australia. <laughs> of course, why not? Oh, oh my god, my I head hurts. I don't see the problem. My cheeks hurt from laughing and my head hurts. Do not send crocodiles. <laughs> Oh, Australia. Austra I don't know what he's saying. Australian reptilian great. conspiracy to place a croc on the throne. <laughs> <laughs>
These are great. I'm so glad that you guys know how to laugh oh, at God. yourselves. I have a headache. <laughs> um, and this is great. <laughs> Let's finish them. <laughs> To all Australian kids, if you ever feel like you're weak or pathetic, remember, you live in the most dangerous and hostile country <laughs> where every creature is murderous and deadly. You're automatically more hardcore than any kid in any other country. <laughs> this is actually quite uplifting. I love Christmas time. Everyone in the UK, Europe and the US is blogging about snow and fireplaces uh -huh. and keeping warm. Whilst here in Australia, just, with no tourists around, Australian scuba tour operators have planted more than 1,000 pieces of coral at the Great Barrier Reef to help restore the marine ecosystem. Australian man kept unique rock for years, assuming it's gold. It turned out to be a rare 4.6 billion year old meteorite. Crap. Yeah, wow. this is actually insane. So this thing weighed 200 kg, and they only died 40,000 years ago and lived in Australia. What? Nice. Mm. Okay. Well, that's crazy. That was hilarious. <laughs> that was that great. That was hysterical. Hopefully you oh. enjoyed watching that. <laughs> did you get some energy? I did. I definitely woke up for sure. <laughs> I hope you got some energy. I got a headache that. and my jaws hurt from laughing, but. <laughs> yeah, my face was a little sore. That was awesome. It's not the cheekbones though. <laughs> Those were great. I know they went a little fast and I hope that wasn't too bothersome to anybody, but. Um... <laughs> Oh my gosh, those were hilarious. They definitely were. I couldn't pick a favorite, but those were hysterical. Um. <laughs> no, I, I mean, that came through at the end of the pathway when the person was trying to walk two dogs, man. That, wow. <laughs> the one with the... I, I'm not going back thinking about it. I, <laughs> I really hope you guys had fun with us too on those and you enjoyed them and uh, were able to take a good laugh with us. Um, we should look at more memes in the future. <laughs> we should. Um... <laughs> Uh, the mullet kid, though. I know. The runner. It wasn't a kid. I'm telling you, the mullet can help with wind resistance. Good to know. Mm -hmm. um, I, I didn't know mullets were like, are they a, a popular thing in Australia? <laughs> we have a tendency to call them, in our area at least, Tennessee waterfalls. Get it? Yep. It's funny. We have fun <laughs> names for, for mullets, but uh, I really thought that was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. Something different to do today. Mm -hmm. I'm glad we did it. Thanks for the um, suggestion. Um, if you guys like this, let us know. Liked it, let us know. And um, which one was your favorite? <laughs> I thought those were all great, but. Um... Yeah, it's just too hard to pick a favorite out of that. <laughs> I, I mean, they were all great. They went so fast, I can't even like. I know. Remember all My of My brain's got to catch up still. Yeah, but those were good. <laughs> and that's definitely a good pick me up for today. And a good way to start today, uh -huh. laughing and um, having some humor. Thank you so much for watching. I thought it was a lot of fun. And uh, again, hope that you guys did the same. So uh, we will see you again next time. Until then, please love like jazz. Be as strong as Tyson. See you next time, guys. Bye. Bye.